I'm Mark Calloway, Applications Engineer for Man and Machine, and today I want to show you what plan regions are and how to use them. In this example, I have two trees both placed on level zero. If I select the trees, you can see that we have a zero offset. Now at present, the level zero view, if we have a look at its extents, will only show elements from the base level up to um, a height of 2300 millimeters and the cut planes at 1500 millimeters. If I increase the offset of one of these trees to above this level, say 4000 millimeters, so if I select this tree here, uh, I'm going to change the offset to 4000 millimeters, apply that, the tree is going to disappear because it's now above the range in which we view. Um, however, I might want these elements to show within this particular floor plan uh, without having to edit the extents for the entire view. Um, and we can do that using a plan region. To find that, I'm going to head over to the view tab. And under plan views, if we click on here, we'll get a little drop down. And we can see we've got plan regions. I'm going to create a plan region around the area where that tree was. Finish that. And I can now edit the extents or the view range for this particular area independently to the rest of the view. So if I go over to the properties window and the cut plane, let's say uh, make that 4100, then we know we're definitely above the level that the tree's on. Uh, I'm just going to change the top offset because that has to be higher than the cut plane, so 4500 for example. Click OK and we can now see that tree even though it's outside the extents of the view. Thank you for watching.